Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the 900, my Battletech Flashpoint series. So today I'm kind of excited. I had a look at the contracts that are on this planet. Pretty sweet, I gotta say. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go into the barracks because we do have experience for our mech warriors that we want to spend. So for 900 for Jesus, I am going to go with tactics. I want to get minus 45 meter minimum range to get those LRMs a little bit more effective. I've been finding the chance they hit has been pretty low only because they, we've been within that, that uh, minimum distance, so this is really going to help, uh, help out. So we're going to confirm that. I'm going to go to Hellburner here, and I think we're probably going to go um, the same way we did last time with some of our other pilots, is we're going to go with Bulwark, going to go with Guts, and confirm that. Confirmed, and we've got Starfish down here. So I'm thinking, um, she's, she's generally piloting the Spider. I think I want to get a sensor lock on her right now and confirm that. And Weasel's got some points to spend down here too, but I think I'm going to hold on to these points. Um, I'm not sure whether we want to go with Bulwark or piloting yet. I'm not 100% sure on her yet. So we're going to hold on to these points for now. And Rover's got one more day till, till she comes back, so we'll have to just wait for that. So let's look at our contracts now. So we've got a one and a half skull assassinate mission. Deniable Destruction, which is two skull, but it's a destroy base, so it might be a little easier for us to do. Escaping Spy, which is an assassinated one skull, which is awesome. Forward Observers, just a regular straight up battle. And then Thorn in the Side, which is another assassinate mission at one and a half skull. So we got three assassinate missions, which gives us the chance to get, you know, better medium mech salvage. I'm not going to guarantee that the uh, mechs are going to be in our, me our medium mechs, but I would wager that they are. So they're going to be good fights, I think. So what I want to do is I want to start, I think, with with Escaping Spy, just to see what we're up against here. We're on a Martian terrain, so it's going to, we're going to be overheating a fair bit, so we're going to have to really watch our heat and watch what we do on this one. But this will give us a good idea if we can handle the one and a half um, Skull Assassinate missions. So let's negotiate this. We're going to go full salvage. We're doing okay before the end of the month. We have a few days, and we've got lots of missions to do, so we're going to go full salvage just because if we do get a chance to get a medium mech, I want to make sure we get lots of parts off of it. So let's confirm this. And we're going to go with our standard lance. I'm going to leave the spider in because I do want that sensor lock. Also, um, this spider can jump and fire a fair bit. So, you know, it's going to be relatively heat efficient, I think, to use the spider. So we're going to go with this route. And we're going to leave uh, starfish in, in this position here. Uh, but I think probably, yeah, you know what? Let's leave Hellburner in, even though she has low spirits. She does have guts um, for Bulwark, which I think I want to keep on her in these three mechs. So we're going to deploy this and get get the mission done here. Command interface initiated. All right, here we go. Four mechs on the ground. So what would make this mission perfect, oh, I hate this map, um, is if we've only get one Lance of Defenders and the Lance of Defenders is a medium mech plus three lights. Now usually there's a second lance up here, but it doesn't look like there is today. Looks like it's just the one and the main guy back here. Now they'll close if he's got long range weapons. We're in a big space here where they can kill us. We have to just be careful where we're going to be maneuvering. Um, it's a tough choice. I mean, in the Rogue Tech series, I've usually moved back here. But if this guy back here is a long range boat, we could be in trouble. So um, also moving into here allows us to get in on this guy as soon as possible and gives but also gives us protection from any long range abilities but it also puts these guys in it at a height advantage so um, what we're going to do is I think just move up into this valley here just to see where we're at first Roger. and then decide a little later if we're going to go back over the hill or if we're going to just stay down here Okay, so let's just keep moving this way, I think. Maybe we can move right on that guy. Moving out. Got the enemy targets now. Enemy detected. Two mechs. Find out okay. what they're here in a second. Kind of flat-footed out in the open here. I don't like this. Two mechs, they're both light. Okay. Panther, nice. Except for the PPC, which I don't like. So we're going to move left here. Attack that panther. Very, very first thing. Um, hey. So 
So here's what we're going to do. We're going to move here. And because we want to try and kill this guy fast, we're going to remove all his evasion with sensor lock. I've got a sensor lock. Thank you. Commando 1D. It's the missile version. Oh, it's the large laser version. I thought it was the... Uh, is that the D? A B, sorry. I thought it was the D there for a second. I'm like, why has he got a large laser? Alright, so let's get... Commander. Ripley first. 60%, not bad. We want to turn and face the other guys, so anytime they fire at us, it'll splash across our body. I'm going to fire on this guy. Ooh, three hits. Nice. Hellburner's next. So it looks like they've got four guys over here. Oh, no. Probably another panther. I can't think of any other mech in this... Uh, in Battle tech here that could have that. So let's... Yeah, it's gonna go... No. We Yeah, we're in better medium range. Yeah, 80% chance to hit. Gonna fire bling on this guy. All weapons are go. Really? With an 80% chance to hit? Really? I was expecting at least three hits there. Yeah, there's that panther. There's, they got three panthers. Jeez, it's almost as bad as fighting the clans with, like, you start fighting them and, at low level in, like, a half skull mission, and they've got, like, three fire starters with Goss rifles that do, like, extra plus five damage or something. They do, they do like, 75 per, <laughs> per Goss rifle. It's insane. All right, um, let's move into here. Yeah, we got to go that, like this. And we'll fire everything on this panther. Hopefully we get lucky. Ah, uh, we got a leg hit on him. Okay. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Yeah. That wasn't bad overall, I think. I'm not sure if, um... No. That was the right choice. What do we got here? 65% chance to hit, eh? So let's do this. Sixteen in the leg, huh? So we're gonna do a precision strike on this guy. I'm gonna try for his leg. Nice, nice shooting. Maybe things are up. Okay, so that pushes him back a turn. We should be able to finish him up with the other two mechs. So that's one panther that we don't have to worry about. Hopefully, after this turn. These guys do have some heavy ordnance, so I have to be very careful here. Yeah, see what I mean? There goes my evasion. I'm well open for PPC hits here. Waiting for orders. Okay, we're going to move in here. Position confirmed. And we're going to shoot on this guy. Going to go after the other leg. Firing. Ah, two hits. Okay, there goes a torso. Two pilot injuries. Reporting critical hit. Yep. Damn it. Receiving you. Let's get back here. Fire on this guy, and we're gonna try for the torso. He's probably dead. Yeah. Target eliminated. Okay, one problem gone. It's gonna shoot on my Vindicator again. Well, at least they're splashing the damage, but it's not helping at all here. Yeah. Thank you. Um. That was CTs. 63 left in the CT. God. I can't even sprint. Okay. 
Well, got our stability back. We're gonna fire on this guy. Fire everything. All weapons committed. Took the wrong arm, unfortunately. Oh, SRM explosion. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. He's almost done. Crap. That's a vindicator. Bitch, any money. Um, okay, tell him Miss Ripley. Roger that. Let's say be gone to this guy. Taking the shot. That could be it. Left leg destroyed. At least we got a knockdown. Stop shooting me. Okay, we got a fire on the other panther. Um, Standing by. On the move. Damn it. Two shots. Uh, I was hoping to take that arm. God damn it. Detecting mech warrior injury. Yeah, I know. Weapon system destroyed. Those stupid PPCs, man. I'm here. It's only 30 damage for melee though. They got a minimum range. You know what? We gotta kill this uh we gotta kill this guy. CT hit, please. Thank you. Enemy down. Ah, oh, we're getting pummeled too. I just got that large laser. Gonna move in here. <sighs> Lisa offers a bit more protection. Brace. Okay. I always have trouble on this map. I should have gone over the hill. I should have gone over this way. Um. everything on this guy's side. Oh, come on, you gotta hit more than that. Okay, PPC crit. It's trying to stay cool. They're not even moving. What's up, boss? Coordinates received. Gotta get that PPC. I think we got it. Okay, there we go. One problem down. Target's taking a critical hit. What no. You say so. See if we can get this arm. Not quite enough. But, that being said, oh man, 28 left in the CT. Oh, what do we get there? Nope, still not enough, but at least he's pushed back a turn. That guy coming in is, oh, yeah, it's gotta be a Vindicator. Oh my god. Another PPC. I'm taking heavy hits. Yeah, you're moving here in a second. Orders. 
that was the right torso. Let's turn our left side a little bit. Roger. Gonna fire on this guy. Uh, let's hope we claim this side. Target acquired. Looks like we did. Okay, there goes that PPC. That hit something good. Okay, two problems solved. Ugh. Ready for orders. Panicking, man. I'm panicking. Gotta not panic. So, let's move here. Panther's got the most armor, I think. So, let's move up front. Gonna fire on the side of this guy. And we gotta, gotta go, just go with three. Firing. God, man. Really? Hey. Affirmative. Into the side of this guy. I'll try. Oh, for crying out loud, that was 75% chance to hit. Of course, I missed. Of course you did. Melee attacks. Okay, good, they missed. Okay, which guy? Not this guy. This guy's got the most damage. So we're gonna fire on this guy. Nice shot. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. That large laser is as good as a PPC. Even better because it's got less heat and it. Uh, oh yeah, there we go. Damn it! Damn it all! I see that. Yes, Commander. What's up, boss? Engaging jump jet. Gonna come back here. Time to get hidden. Can only fire two on this guy. That should probably do it. Nope. Of course. Why would we hit anywhere we need to kill this guy? Fifty damage, really? Internal structure disintegrating. Standing by. Fire both. Okay. Oh, he blew up his head. Nice. Well, he deserved that. Can't get over the amount of damage from a physical attack from that, that mech. Took a hard hit there. It's like, why... If it's 50 damage for a melee attack, why even put weapons on mechs? You just smash them into each other. It, you know, I don't, I don't get it. Anyway, uh, we only can fire one laser on this guy. Roger. But at least we're hidden from that Vindicator now. I guess we're not. Wow. Come on, kill him. Right. We're gonna have to get right on that Vindicator. I bet he's fully armored too. Damage looks light, Commander. Yeah, it always looks light at first. 
Yeah, fully armored. We got to shoot him through the back. So, um, you need to move first. Wow, 20 internal structure. Okay, that's probably the safest place to go, but we don't want to turn our left torso. Uh, Something like that, maybe. Fire both on this guy. Yep, let's make sure we hit him where we haven't hit him before. Great, perfect. Nicely done. Yes, Commander. Heading out. Okay, let's try again. We can get how many on this guy now? Two, three? Two. Locking on target. And yes, Commander. That'll just jump me into harm's way here. See what he does. Not much he can do, really. Hope we get some eyes on this guy soon. Ah, great, another 50 point damage attack. Unreal. Unreal. Okay. All right, we'll deal with it. Um, spider. Yes, commander. That guy can't see us other than missile weapons. So he's only got forty-seven left in the CT. Let's just fire on him. Okay, firing everything. Okay, there's a leg destruction, which means we get another turn on him next turn. Like Alright, now let's see if we can torso the other side. Standing by. Hopefully we get the torso hit. On it. One miss. Are you serious? I bet he's got two left in his torso. Sure does. Standing by. Confirmed. We gotta make sure we get the kill on this guy. Okay, so that's it for that guy. Ugh. It was the three panthers. That's what it was. If we didn't have the three panthers against us, it wouldn't have been anywhere near this bad. So let's give ourselves another turn here. I think the spider needs to move though. Like that. You say so. I think this guy should order. move here. Acknowledged. Gotta take that PPC first. Ok, 
Okay. I want a Vigilance, though. I think I do. We're gonna brace. I wanna go before him. So, let's start off with Starfish. Standing by. Um... If we don't jump, he went from here to here. He can go from there to the top of the hill. <sighs> now it'll really depend on... He's got two chevrons of evasion. Chunky right arm armor. So we're just going to have to shoot straight out, I think. Copy that. Firing alpha. Our primary target is taking damage. Okay. Receiving you. Got to maximize our evasion here. Up high. Gonna put four into his side. Nice, four hits. Ready for orders. Uh. So the right side's damage, we'll turn the left. Still on the side here, we gotta shoot as many lasers as we can. Got it. Oh, nice. Okay, what structure is exposed though? Hopefully it's the arm. Torso. Ah, oh God, it's got 55 left. Hopefully he can't see us from there. Uh, should we precision strike? I think so. I'm gonna try for a torso hit. And we hit completely opposite side from where we want to hit. Really? Okay, we got lucky there. The target is retreating, Commander. Eliminate it before it escapes. Where is he going to? That's what I want to find out here. Way back there. Well, at least we'll be able to shoot him in the back. Um, you have to jump. Don't really have a choice here. Okay, let's fire into this guy's side. Oh my god. not fire. We can sensor lock him though. That'll help. Hell burner with the burners on. Let's get up over here. That's the right side. We gotta turn left if we can. It's a pretty good chances to hit. Uh, let's try a precision strike on him again. Let's go for the torso hit. Engaging the target. Of course not. Commander. We're not jumping. Acknowledged. We need to get our heat back and give him another different target. We're gonna fire four straight out. Copy that. We get the torso? Of course not. Why would we get the torso? All right, um... Let's see here. Oh, down to five. Let's go for a headshot. Maybe we get lucky. Well...
Oh, he's just plain out running. Um, how does he get four chevrons of evasion running that far? Oh, he's a... Uh, I don't even know. Right here. Right side, right side. I want to shoot him from the front, though. Actually, let's just move, like, here. Get a little bit of heat thing resources back and use this on him. That'll help out. Okay. Waiting for orders. Maybe we get lucky. And fire three. Roger that. Oh, looks like we might. Okay, there goes the PPC. Pilot injury. That hit something good. Standing by. Um. Location. That's Melium. Get some heat reserves back. Okay, there goes the left torso. So he's a stick now. Solid connection on that one. He's still got a ways to go. He's going full sprint though. I can't shoot him. Gonna go full sprint. That's how he got the evasion last time, is the full sprint. Um, God, we can't do much with this guy. We have to have to core him. We can't let him get away. Target confirmed. Right, if only if we can hit him. Negative damage. God, really? Commander. On my way. Got it. Okay, two hits. Nice chunky side hits. Standing by. Come on, let's get some payback. Payback for that arm you're missing. Nice. All right, now we got a shot on him. Firing. Wait, we get the leg. Nope. Oh, nice. He doesn't have much left. He's going down. Nice try, buddy. Yes, Starfish, payback's all yours. Moving to position. Payback's a bitch, buddy. Affirmative. Oh, not quite. Yes, Commander. Moving out. Man, this guy must be terrified. I'm surprised he hasn't bailed out. Engaging target. There it is, folks. Mission. Okay, so that was a painfully won one skull mission. Painfully won. It's the repair time I'm more worried about. I mean, we got stuff to put everything back together, but... It's the repair time, right? However, we do now have a panther. And that's what I want. That's what I want more than anything, I think, is this panther. We might get the Vindicator part great, but I think we need the panther. So let's see what we get here. We got the commando part, good. Vindicator part, cool. Medium laser. Nice. Alright, cool. 
Yep, we got to do major repairs. We got some pilots out. So let's have a look at the Mac Bay. Man. That's just, a, this one's just a quick repair. So let's do that first. And the Spider. I like this guy. We're going to refit him. So it's really just the three jump jets that we need. Which we have. Still eight days of repair though. And let's have a look at the commando here. I think what we're gonna do. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna uh, put the this guy in storage. Let's have a look at this guy. Refit. Because we're gonna bring that Panther into play now. So let's repair everything. We lost our LRM LRM10 and medium laser and a heatsink. Not too bad. Could have been a lot worse. So let's put the LRM10 back in. And we got a medium laser we need to put in. And a heatsink. So overall, not too bad. Could have been a lot worse with the heatsink here. Could have been a lot worse. Although this one's plus 40 melee damage. The arm mod. I wonder if we should put that in the spider. Oh, it's three tons though. Let's confirm this. Yeah, let's move the panther up. Let's move this panther up. Jenner. So we're going to refit this panther too. And I think what I want to do with this guy is do this. And we need to put LRM 10 ammo in. And we need one of these guys. And then a max armor. So we got a little bit of armor left, or a little bit of uh, tonnage left over. We do need heat sinks though. Or do we? No, actually we don't. Um, LRM ammo, this gives us 12 turns of firing, so that's probably fine. And let's have a look here. Maybe we can put in, uh, do we have point defense? We don't. So I mean we could put in, what's this guy got? That's 35 heat though. Plus 2 accuracy for the PPC though. I mean we could downgrade the LRM-10. So if we go this route, like if let's, because this thing's got accuracy, right? That's really really the reason why I want it. If we downgrade that, drop this to, let's say, let's say we add, this is 3 tons, right? It's 12 heat though. We could put an SRM-4 in. But if we want this guy to be a long range firepower mech, then we do definitely need to go um, this route, I think. And let's add, got that jump jet there. So we're going to need um, heat sinks for sure. What's our heat at right now? Yeah, a couple heat sinks, I think. Jump jet can stay in the center torso. I think we can go that route. Plus two accuracy with the PPC. I mean, it might be better with four medium lasers and an SRM-6. But then again, it's the issue of heat, right? We're running four medium lasers on the other guy and he's overheating for a bit. I'm going to try this loadout. Let's confirm this. It's nine days. And let's do... Um, let's have a look at this guy. Our heat sinking is what? 48, 48. Just thinking about using this guy as a melee. Like this arm mod, plus 40 melee damage is pretty impressive. Like if we drop it in on this guy. Why is this? Oh right, because we've yeah, that makes sense. So if we do that, do that, and then do we do th uh, this for heat management, and then still got like half a ton left. We can put in like another jump jet or something. 
No, we can't put in another jump jet. We only can use four, unfortunately. Um, I mean, we become extremely heat inefficient. But the benefit is, is that we can get in close and just punch people out. Like the plus 40 melee damage. That's going to give us like 90 damage, right? Let's try this. So we got a long time to wait before we get our mechs back. Let's manage our tasks a little better here. So we're going to move, I think... We could go... Let's pull a... Jenner's only two days, though. Vindicator definitely needs to come back. Two Panthers definitely need to come back, I think. And then let's go Jenner Spider, I guess. Let's try that. Alright, so we are going to need money for the financial report, so let's go to the store here. We got a bunch of stuff we can sell. So, um, let's sell the flamers because we're definitely not going to need these flamers right now. Um, let's sell four medium lasers. Starting to get there. Uh, these guys can all go. It's not much money, but. It's something. Okay. SRM 2s, let's sell them both. I don't <laughs> How close are we going to get here? Sell two of those. Keep the heat sinks. Uh, we can start, we can sell a bit of this anyway. Let's just sell five. We'll sell two of these. Sell this. Still short by a fair bit. So we're not going to sell any mechs. I want to keep those. Large laser. It's all our backup stuff, right? Yeah. I want to keep the AC5. Sell one more of each of these. Yeah, that's just enough. Look at that. Alright. So we're going to go and get our stuff back. And when we do, we're going to end the episode here. Cool, we got, uh, you know, 1,359 sea pills. <laughs> Spider's coming back after the next financial report. So the next mission we take, we're definitely going to have to go down and uh, get some good cash. Yeah, thanks, Darius. I'm going to have to deal with Darius to <laughs> do this whole thing. So uh, if you liked the episode, please drop a like. Um, that was a really, really bad run for sure. Yeah, gone. thanks, Darius. Um, if you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel, please, please feel free to do so. I've got a couple of other uh, series on there, two Rotech series, one with the new version of Rotech and one with the older version. Going on, yeah, thanks, Darius. Um, so go check those out. Also, uh, feel free to comment. I really love the comments if you think I could have done something different than that last mission. I'm thinking I should have gone left. Rather than gone out the center. Broke, Thank you, Darius. Um, but anyway, yeah, so I'm going to leave it there for today. And until next time, we'll see you all later.